<laughs> so recently I met a girl from high school because of the Facebook that Sean was talking about. Anybody ever do that? You met someone from high school after about 10 years? You know what I'm talking about. High school. Yeah, high school. You think you're going to hook up with her, right? You think about it. And she was like, totally dirty talking to me. So I was like, awesome. I'm going to hook up with this girl. When I met her, she had a very, very pronounced stutter. Now, I'm not the kind of guy to judge someone who has a stutter, but the only thing that ran through my head was as she was going, I want to be a lawyer. I was like, lawyer? How much am I going to pay you just for a phone call to your hello? Don't lawyers charge by the hour? That and not that, and then they went to the dirty side where it was like, dirty talk would be weird too, because, you know, oh, good, 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 good. And I'm like, yes, I'm awesome. Good, 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 good. Get off my hair. Fatty. I like smoking cigars, so I was downtown at a place called Thomas Hines on Carlton. Has anybody ever been there? Right. And there's a lot of crazy people downtown. And I wasn't sure this one guy, because he was running around screaming about not showing people files. And I was like, maybe he's just on Bluetooth, because I obviously look like a nut when I'm talking on Bluetooth. I figured out he was on the Bluetooth when he started picking up butts. <laughs> and also, I was talking about de-alcoholized beer with a girl lately at a bar, and here's a way to not win a girl over. I was like, who the hell drinks de-alcoholized beer? That's so fucking stupid. She was like, maybe people like my dad, who's a recovering alcoholic. <laughs> Awkward moment. And then, of course, I responded to her because I'm a smart ass. I'm like, maybe your dad shouldn't be drinking something that tastes like the problem. <laughs> Did you ever think he's riding a little too close to the edge on that one, maybe? <laughs> I'm diabetic. That's like me going, hey, maybe I should drink a gallon of molasses. Is that a good idea for today? Yeah, I wasn't really using my right foot. I don't need that. It's cool. I'm diabetic. I'm allowed to make that joke. Right. And who's uh, seen the news about these new full body scanners they're getting at the airport? One person. Awesome. Thanks, buddy. Now, who here feels nervous about that and feels it infringes on your privacy? You got a small dick, Porteous. <laughs> that's why you're worried. Don't shave. Yeah, that's right, because you don't shave. <laughs> it still makes your dick short, it just looks bigger when you shave. Exactly. Now, I've come up with a way to get around two problems I have at the airport. Number one, I want to freak the guy out when he full body scans me, right? So I'm going to get a footlong from Subway, have it hang right down there. And then when he scans me and finds it and they have to strip search me and it's a Subway sandwich, I'm looking to be like, look, see, here's the deal. <laughs> Tickets are really expensive now, and you guys stop serving food. <laughs> I'm kind of a big guy, so I had to find a way around that, and I kind of thought, you know, if you just scanned me and didn't check, the girls behind me would think I had a huge dick. <laughs> Oh, brother out. <laughs> For real. <laughs>